Uh, good evening, I'm Dick Brennan. Police investigating the shooting of a 15-year-old boy now in critical condition in Brooklyn. CBS 2's Christina Fan, live in Bensonhurst with the latest developments. Christina? Christina and Dick, this block is still swarming with police officers hours after the shooting happened in broad daylight. You can see paper cups on the ground behind us that mark shell casings and they are scattered across both sides of the street. We also want to turn your attention to the opposite street corner. That is where witnesses say they saw the 15 year old victim getting CPR after getting shot. The shooting unfolded just after 1 p.m. on 62nd Street and 20th Avenue in Brooklyn. Witnesses say they heard a quick succession of gunfire and then saw a group of teenagers making a run for the nearby subway station. On the street, witnesses found the victim with a gunshot wound to the back. He was taken to Maimonides Hospital in critical condition. Families say gunfire and police tape, not a common sight in this quiet neighborhood. I hear like, boom, 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 five time shot, and I opened the window. And it was Jewish lady downstairs, and I asked her, "Is this a gunshot?" She said, "It looked like." And and when I look from the window, all of a sudden I see like whole a bunch of kids. They run to the subway. I asked some student how this happened. He say he says some some student got shot. That's it. We did find a police presence at the nearby FDR High School, but it's unclear at this time if the victim or the suspect were students there. Witnesses also told us they saw a group of teenagers putting on face masks and swinging a bat about a block away from the shooting before it happened, but they are unsure if they were involved. So far, police tell us no arrests have been made and they have not offered any suspect descriptions. For now, reporting live from Bensonhurst, Brooklyn, Christina Fan, CBS 2 News. All right, Christina, thank you.